yeah, welcome to a new game against um, some Norwegian flag guy. We've got many Norwegian flags here, and I, s I suppose it's, uh, it's got something to do with the world's number one. And maybe these guys aren't all from Norway. <laughs> okay, so we uh, got a Maroxy bind here. Black now. Oh, Queen B6. Uh, this is a rare move. It doesn't have um, a great reputation. Um, the question is though, do I want Knight C3 and allow him to take? This is the only reason uh, behind reasoning behind this that you want to take on c3. Maybe I can just go here on knight f6, play f3. I needed to cover b2, yeah. This is why I need to react at all. And then knight c3 next move, and then knight d5 is is um, is a standard uh, issue here anyway in this position. But now he's uh, played knight, queen to c7, knight d5. Is um is has gained in, in strength even. I don't need to play it instantly, of course. Ah. Mm -hmm. I don't think he can take. Would 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 be surprising. Yeah, of course, he takes instantly. Just like uh, saying, "Okay, <laughs> I don't care what you are doing." Okay. So knight d5, yeah, of course. Uh, if he goes to b5 or a6, knight c7 wins the exchange. Uh, okay, he can go to a4. And then I've got uh, got uh, some options. Can just take e7 with check. Not too bad. Um, can go. I can also go knight uh, knight c7. It's uh, also on knight c7 rook b8 and let's say queen a5, intending to play bishop a7, winning the exchange. I can also take on e7 as mentioned. Just uh, just grab there. Okay, let's let's try this. I think it's it's an interesting way. He can take a2 maybe. Yeah, well, this kind of approach, just uh, move instantly and hope it's working. Uh, it, it can work in blitz. It's it's uh, sometimes just a matter of luck and not of uh, of anything else. People play instant moves and hope they're working. Okay, take here, he will take the knight. Um, actually, it is um, more interesting to try to trap the queen. Uh, is this possible, maybe? Queen c2, yeah. Queen c2 would uh, threaten this. And... Uh, yeah, okay, I need to move at uh, at some point. I thought knight uh, to d4 would be uh, good now, but I overlooked something. <laughs> uh, okay. Okay. Uh, but I can can go here, right? And uh, rook a1. What is he doing now? If rook c if rook c8 is working, uh, I'll eat my head. Yeah, probably it is working. Isn't this isn't this an unfair game sometimes? <laughs> okay. Rook c8. He will take a1 with check here. Yeah? Unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. Okay, um, can I move something else? Bishop c5, it's all, all not working. 
amazing. Yeah, it's just it's just uh, funny. Yeah? <laughs> Maybe Norwegians are unbelievably lucky, and this is Carlson's uh, <laughs> Carlson's secret. He's lucky like this guy. Okay, now I'm trapping the rook, and uh, maybe he's got some miracle escape again. I was actually calculating this, <laughs> that he's not able to take. At least uh, this was, uh, yeah, maybe he's got knight g4 or some, yeah, this is maybe even working, I can't believe it. Yeah, see, he didn't plan this. It's just, it's just a coincidence that this is working. I doesn't see it even. Yeah, this would have been good for black. Amazing. So what is this? Four pawns, five pawns? No, six. He's got six pawns, right? But I've got the open file. It's not so clear. Rooks are, are strong pieces. If they get uh, on the seventh rank and and stuff like that. And uh, what e five? Yeah, I know it looks weird, but I want to take on e five. He shouldn't play d five. And uh, yeah, yeah, he can he can give this check. It's it's not so so terrible. And just needed to make sure that he cannot play d5. Yeah, I need to catch up a bit on the clock. These moves are maybe not uh, perfect, but um, being down on time, I need to react to that. Yeah, I'm catching up a bit on the clock. He takes now king eight king yeah. How does he uh, protect this now? He doesn't. So a uh, mate now or what? This would be a fun end. <laughs> I don't see it. What is the threat? I just grab grab all this. I don't see a threat really. Check. Yeah, and white is winning in the end game now. Black yeah, this was uh, quite quite a chaotic uh, chaotic game. And uh, one 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 really fun issue is here. I can just play knight g4, and I'm resigning. He uh, he stumbled into this, but uh, <laughs> uh, he didn't find it for for some reason. It's not so difficult. Knight g4 now. Can I can let's just take back a couple of moves. Must go here, and and I'm and then it's totally out, totally over. Cannot if I take here he he wins the house e three and d four. I have no move, so it's it's really amazing that uh here rook c eight can be played. I mean <laughs> it's just uh, all uh, a string of coincidences working. 
And uh, well, my idea here was was obviously bad. I mean, this move. I can take uh, I can take on a8. It's 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 not clear really what's what's going on. Just um, just a position to uh, to play. And here, of course, yeah, as usual, the computer plays uh, the simplest line, and it's it's good. Yeah, of course, I can take, and uh, this looks somehow better for white. Structure is just better, but uh, that is that is even uh, that this even was on so. Quite. Ah, knight d5 wins. Hmm, I didn't really think at this position at all. Knight d5. Yeah, it's not so difficult. Knight d5. So this here. Yeah, this isn't easy. this isn't uh, difficult really. Takes here, take here, and now just um, two pieces saying he can play something like this and uh, continue this stuff. I mean, this is an exchange. It's fairly solid still for black. He's got some chances to to maybe keep this uh, somehow um, keep on playing. But um, all in all, a very um, <laughs> chaotic game. Yeah, thanks for watching. I hope you. Um, enjoyed the ups and downs.